Okay, we are here on the part three of the same plan. We call it a stone breaker. We call it a seat under leaves. It's a common plan. Now we will be talking about the kidney. You know the kidney is most of the organ in the body that work 24-7 in the body. And uh, the kidney is supposed to be always healthy. So in the part uh, three of the story, we'll be talking about how to bring out kidney stones, how to take care of kidney stones with the same plan. But if you are new on this channel, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Make sure you share with friends, share with family. Drop a comment below at the comment section what you think about African medicines, what you think about African culture, what you think about African tradition at the comment section. Make sure you subscribe, then click the notification button so that anytime we drop a video, you can always be notified. Keep on watching till the end of the video. I will tell you what can cause kidney problems and I will tell you the treatment which is this plan I am holding here right now, which is the plan we call it um, seat under leaves. Keep on watching till the end of the video. In today's video, we'll be talking about what can cause kidney damage, what can easily damage the kidney. Number one, first thing that can damage the kidney is red meat whether pork meat whether goat meat whether cow meat whether chicken meat anything red meat is dangerous into the kidney it's very very dangerous it gives you 40 percent of can give you kidney failure 40 percent in the body so we advise you avoid eating red meat or eat in low quantity and then um, excess fish too no fish will stay as long as it can at the fridge refrigerator it will stay there five years, six years. When you are eating the fish, you don't know. It can cost you kidney problem. It costs you forty percent high risk. Give you kidney problems. And some of you don't understood why proteins in kidney disease is supposed to be limited. Limit the way you eat things that can give you more proteins in the meat. We are coming with number two, which is salt. Reduce the way you eat salt. Salt. When you eat too much salt, be careful about salt because salt is very dangerous to destroy a kidney. Because it has the ability to retain water into the system. So it's very dangerous. And you know, when you take too much of salt, high blood pressure will come, different diseases will come. So salt is very dangerous to kidneys. We advise you. You want to be well healthy with the kidney avoid salt number three we are coming with number three and uh, with this same plan you can actually detoxify number three we are talking about uh, stay away from overusing painkillers overusing painkillers antibiotics overusing painkillers or antibiotics that can treat infections or by using them capsules those capsules painkillers abofofine acanafine all these things you have to stay away from that because when you take excess of those capsules it will affect your kidney at the long run so you have to avoid them it's very dangerous to human system it's very dangerous it cause kidney failure it cause kidney problems it cause kidney stones it's very dangerous into the human system. So we advise you that. Then things like fried potatoes, canned food, processed food, fast food, all these things, you have to stay away from them. It can cause kidney problems. Number four, you have to drink a lot of water. If you are not drinking a lot of water, it will cause you kidney failure. So you have to learn how to drink more water. Because if you don't drink more water, it will give you kidney problems. So you have to always drink water so that your kidney will function very well. Because kidney functions very well with water. That is the fourth thing. So when you drink a lot of water, and when you get up in the morning, the time to drink water is very good. When you're going to bed to sleep, you drink water. When you get up in the morning, you drink water. Stay away from kidney disease. You'll be healthy with kidney problems. So when you have kidney problems, you have to drink a lot of water in a day. So even though you don't have kidney problems,
you have to drink more water. Number five, stay away from processed drinks, Fanta, Coca-Cola, all these processed drink, Planet, all these drinks. Stay away from them because of the chemicals they are there, the kidney problems will come more. So when you consume those soft drinks, excess sugar is there. Processed drinks will give you kidney problems. So you have to avoid them at core or cause. And especially if your kidney already damaged, you don't have to drink them. What a man, what a woman. You have to get this advice for you to be healthy. You have to get this advice for you to be strong. Because our future is to look forward for you guys to be healthy. That's our priority as African. We are bringing African back to the world, bringing African back to culture. So avoid all these things I just mentioned right now. If you avoid all these things, your kidney will be healthy. So when you consume those drinks, you have a problem. Number six. Number six. You have to, if you have kidney problem, you have to be doing more of exercise. More of exercise. The more of exercise, when you get up in the morning, you at least one or two hours, you walk around, you do exercise around. That one, you stay away from kidney disease. If you can do that, all these six things I just mentioned, whether your kidneys are already failed, if you may, with the things I've mentioned, the six things, if you follow them up, then you consume this plan I am about to teach you right now, you will be healthy with your kidney. Because we discovered that 25% of the world population, they have these symptoms of the kidney problems coming their way. So that's the reason why we come out to reintroduce nature to Africans. And this is part three of the story. If you can get this plan, this is a seed under leaf or stone breaker for kidney stones to detoxify the kidney for kidney failure. You can still use the plan. How are you going to use it? You have to get a garden X leaves. If you get garden X leaves, get the garden egg leaves at least. One handful of the garden egg leaves. Then you get this plan, uproot the plant from the roots right down to the leaves. Get a one handful of the plant. Then you are going to boil it together with uh, at least five liters of water for 20 minute boiled. The garden eggs leaves together with this plant. Boil them together with five liters of water. Every morning you drink one cup. You add honey to your taste. If you don't have honey, natural honey, natural honey. If you don't have natural honey, you drink like that. You have to be drinking in morning and evening. Morning and evening. At least for 20, that's three months, 90 days. Before 90 days, kidney failure, kidney problem, kidney detoxification, anything kidney problem become a history with this plan. It's very wonderful. Keep on watching. We are coming out with uh, part four of the plan, how to take care of hepatitis A, hepatitis B, hepatitis C with this same plan. So keep on watching, share with friends, share with family, drop a comment below at the comment section what you think about African medicines, what you think about African tradition, what you think about African culture. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel. Click the notification button anytime we drop a video. You can always be notified.